I want to specifically thank our beloved governor, His Excellency Pastor Omo Obaseno, who is so passionate about the welfare of our five Omites and has demonstrated strategic leadership with the Arise Agenda Dialogue that brought all Akwaibom people to the table, irrespective of politics, culture, religion, and ethnicity. Its commitment was improving the health condition of all residents of Akwaibom State was very visible during the Arise Dialogue. He emphasized that he placed a serious premium on the welfare of our five people. This is demonstrated by actively involving the primary healthcare development agency and the state health insurance agency. Health insurance is a social security network that guarantees the provision of needed health services to persons on the payment of token contribution at regular intervals. The agency is established with a mandate to manage and to regulate the health insurance scheme for all residents of our five states. What are the programs that we have? We have the formal sector scheme, the informal sector, the vulnerable group, and then we also use adoption. The aim is to bring in everybody. The recently passed act, um, yeah, the National Health Insurance uh, Act 2020, 2022, that is now a law, states that health insurance all over this country must be mandatory. Mandatory for everybody. In fact, we have actually started the process of accrediting the healthcare facilities we are going to use. And that is not done in isolation. We must do it together with the National Health Insurance Authority. That is mandatory for us to be able to um, get our people benefit from the provision of the basic healthcare form. Enrollment of beneficiaries to begin with the vulnerable group using the basic health provision form. And this will start within one month from now, once we are done with setting up of the ICT unit. Because the ICT unit is very key, very important. That is where we have the data. So if you don't have a functional ICT, you won't be able to track what is happening. Even to be able to detect fraud might be difficult. That is why emphasis is placed on having a robust ICT and with well-trained staff to handle that. The journey towards providing all residents of Aquaibon State with access to equitable, affordable, quality, and sustainable healthcare services through Aquaibon State Health Insurance Scheme is on course. We want to um, assure our beloved governor and his team that Aquaibon State Health Insurance Agency, together with the Primary Healthcare Development Agency, will surely deliver on the mandate. We will not disappoint the people of Aquaibon State.